Hi everybody. Uh, Nexus One Cyanogen Mod Six RC Three. Um. So let's get into this. So first, um, let me boot the phone up. So let's do that. So um, now it's booting up, and you can see the screen where the X with all the colors in the bootloader unlocked. And. Uh, Let's wait for that. Okay, now there comes the custom, um, custom boot up screen with the Sanjin mod guy, Android guy, and then the circular. I don't even know. Let's keep it going and, uh, okay, so that was pretty quick. Quick and unusual, actually. So, um, Let's unlock the screen since the phone just booted up. And uh, so I actually, this is not how it's going to look when you actually flash the ROM, but I just put all my stuff together. But when you start up the ROM, you'll be, um, there'll be a widget, it'll be home screen tips widget. It'll look like that. So, uh, it'll be home screen tips and some jokes of the Android, um, developer stuff. So, the, this is the home screen for Cyanogen Mod. This is the ADW launcher. That's what Cyanogen Mod uses as their, um, launcher. It's nice, it's customizable, it has, uh, the sense. The sense previews, it's fast, it's quick. Signage one is really fast, let's just kill those apps. And uh, so this is how that looks. And uh, let's go back in there. I actually um, said CPU and overclocked my phone, so it's that much. 45 minimum, 1113 max megahertz. Let's go back home. So, there's some changes, not really, not that noticeable. So, there's on the super users. Okay, so we have Torch with um, the strobe lights and everything. nice to have and then I have um super users as I said before super users it's fine but oh it's right there so they changed it and they added log and settings and uh, as you can see right there it's e it's easier to uninstall an application. Just hold it like you were going to throw it. Just hold, and it'll say "drop to uninstall," and then it'll say "continue." Since I don't want to, I'm just gonna cancel that. But you can see, you can change those uh, things in the Froyo. You can like stock on the music app. They change some stuff like that over there and then you can see the background it's nice let me put an album artwork one on so you can see how they do that right there and then over there it's on that CD cover and they have some new widgets let me just show you those
So those were the widgets. And, uh, let's see. Not really noticeable changes. Oh, they added the. to its own app. BSP Manager. Uh, let's go into the settings, and then you have your ADW launcher and signage in mod settings. And, uh, screen preferences. I'm sorry for this bad camera. In Signage Mod, there's application settings, allow application movie, install location, internal, external, automatic, input settings, all this stuff. Haptic feedback tweaks, long press home screens, lock screen music control. So let me just lock the phone. And it'll be down there with that play button. Trackball wake. So you can wake your phone up with the trackball like that. Trackball unlock. Menu unlock. Then performance settings. Warning dragons ahead. They're just saying don't mess with this stuff because you could permanently mess your phone up. Use JIT. Enable surface. Lock home and memory, that stuff. Performance settings, sorry, how we just hear. Um, the user interface, LED notifications, power prompt, render effect, date provider, notification colors, tweaks, extras, accelerometer, stuff, reflow after pigeon, screen. All that stuff. And that's basically it. So let's just wait for the official ROM to come out. There will be more videos coming. Can you please rate, comment, and subscribe? Watch more videos like the desired one. Thank you for watching and bye.